lot of what ifs. Um, I I just know me and I try not to focus on the what if. Michelle Dodson was working from home and was just feet from where the gunfire erupted. She provided this picture from where one of the bullets pierced an interior door. I peeked out this way first and saw how it went through the window and I was like, oh, I have a, and then I looked back in and I was like, but what Sheriff Bob Gualtieri finds amazing is the officers who responded kept their composure. As Officer Kuznetsov arrived at the driver's side door, Kingo's fired around, and as described by Officer Kuznetsov, it literally whizzed by his head. He said he could hear the round whiz by his head. It was that close. Today, the sheriff's office released body and dash cam video from the scene. Shortly after the exchange of gunfire, officers took Kingos into custody and rendered aid as he suffered a gunshot wound to the leg. Officers were initially there on Saturday because Kingos was accused of violating this restraining order. A woman who works nearby filed it after she claims he kept showing up at her business, proclaiming his love for her and sending her unwanted gifts. Dotson tells Aid on your side there didn't seem to be anything unusual about him. Mostly kept to himself. He seemed like a nice enough person.